I've always wanted to climb the ladder of just like how much further can I take this? And so when I started to treat my business like an entrepreneur, like I was running a company, that's where my mindset just got bigger. My name is Reese. I am a tattoo artist based out of San Diego, California. I have been tattooing for 13 years. Honestly, I was always pretty obsessed with the culture of tattooing. I was getting tattoos the day I turned 18, it was like right out of college. Went to a wine and paint night and I found out I could paint, so I quit my job cold turkey, went back to school for fine art, and here I am. <laughs> I would consider my tattoo style definitely abstract realism, a lot of opaque black and grays with spots of color. I love to do warrior women portraits and lots of flowers. I love just making people feel really, really confident in their skin. And I truly believe that it's about telling stories, having people move from insecurities to unapologetic self-expression through their own unique ways of decorating their own body. I like to look at business, art, being a creative, is, is, it's all encompassing. I think creating content is art, I think art is art, I think tattoos are art, I think your business is your art. Once I started looking at it from that lens, it became so much more fun versus like, oh, I gotta answer DMs or oh, I gotta create content. It was like, oh no, I get to create something that comes from my soul. I am an educator and uh, a mentor and a coach for tattoo artists and I help them understand marketing and take social media to a next level so that they can call in their soulmate clients, is what I like to call them, and really grow their businesses. And so I look at social media as like a gangster move. The universe was like, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you the social medias and here's a free platform that you get to share who you are, the embodiment of your work and the tattoos that you do. When it comes to the beginning stages of your career, absolutely invest money into good equipment because in the long run, it's always going to shape how you understand how to use a machine instead of fighting the machine to do a good job. I really, really take good care of the equipment that I have, whether it be from the machines all the way down to the lights. And it's like, I really want something that's going to give me the best possible outcome that I can get. So the lights that I have right now, uh, I really love the two lights just because it gives me double angles and it gives me, it, it, it avoids the shadowing. So like my own shadows create my biggest obstacles so if I can get, avoid my own shadow, like my own creation of my own shadow as I'm tattooing, lighting is everything. If I'm in the dark with this, especially since I do color, um, I'm gonna be missing out on some tones there. Advice to aspiring tattoo artists, I would say, to forge ahead right now, it might be a little bit hard to get into the industry, but don't give up. One of those things is, is that really just focus on your art, really focus on what it is that you desire, really see that vision and hold that vision for a future that doesn't exist yet, knowing it's about to come around and come to you. Next for Reese, well, I consider myself a CEO of a tattoo empire, so I am just building my empire, I own a shop, I'm bringing more people into my this new brand new tattoo shop that I just built. Um, I'm also building up my education and mentoring and coaching for tattoo artists so that they can build tattoo empires themselves. You can follow me on all the platforms. I've got me a YouTube, a podcast, I've got Instagram and TikTok, all at The Art of Reese. Um, and you can look us up at theedgeinc.com for any coaching and tattooing.